or so. We'll grab some bits more stuff pushed out. Yeah, you know, gotta keep trundling along to this. What's this 500? <laughs> Thank you for your help. Wonder if I can get this and Hello. Welcome to Talbot's Tannery. <coughs> Thanks again for your help. Uh, uh, I love those boots. Get your protective Where'd you get them? Gear here. Some serious ass with these. That's a cold cash. Get sure what it is. Yeah. Ooh, we should get something hot to drink for the trip home. Hey, strangers. Randy's the name. Automobiles are the game. Flab's master. Not particularly. It's boring work. I only get pulled in if something breaks that a tender can't fix. So I spend most of my time just waiting here, like I'm doing now. But beggars can't be choosers. No offense, but you're a gamble in a hard luck casino. Don't like working in the bazaar. Some months ago, my dad wrote me that he thought he'd seen folks skulking around our homestead. I dismissed it. Our place has always been isolated and safe. Stupid. Turns out it was a small band of one of them crazy planes gangs. They sent me a letter. My parents are dead, and they're holding my kid brother and sister hostage. I I ain't even close to having enough money to pay the ransom. Even if I did, I suspect they'd just kill us all after I pay. I'm not one to condone violence, but I've heard of what you <clears throat> folks have been doing all across Colorado. Whatever you think is needed. Ooh. Let me show you where to find our old homestead. I'll meet you there. You help out the get fan. See you there. It don't take too long, okay? Get cool. something hot to drop. We should get something hot to drink for the trip home. We'll come back on our way out. Hello again, esteemed guests. Ah, yes. Paradolia Jones would be the man you're looking for. He'll be hanging out at the Fountain Bar. Right there. Enjoy your visit. Guns sanctified with blood. Blood sanctified by guns. Ah, oh, shit. That weird guy in the fountain? He's staring at us again. Don't Can make we check eye out Pichatelli's shop Maybe next? He'll... Oh, shit. 
That weird guy in the fountain? I love those check out the Chateli shop next. Get him here, here! Fill up, Barkeep! I'll tell you when to quit. Hmm. Howdy, ma'am. Howdy. Always good to see a Wesson. Could you... Could you please take that away? I don't like ducks. Oh, thank you. I see. Not my usual line of business, but I don't see why not. My normal rates would apply for a one-way transport. Okay, okay. I hear you. No need to make a man feel bad about trying to earn a living. All right. Thanks to the Patriarch, this stretch of land from Denver in the north to Steeltown in the south. I could tell you more, but truth be told, the only way to know the land is to travel it. Hey, so it didn't cost us $300, which I don't even really have, so... <laughs> Ah, welcome to Young Vincent's. No. Okay. Fill her up, Bert. Fill her up, Bert Keith. Oh, I'll tell amigos. you when to quit. Como mm. estas? Doc says I got the pot. Dr. Cold Cuts can do sure, what the hell's that? All right, I guess now I can go to that clown place and fuck him up. Ah, oh, Mr. Sizzlepede. Really need to ask Piscatelli to look at my gun. Ah, bugger keeps jamming. November Cowboys. You reading me out there, Caballeros? You all recovered from that big old Colorado welcome the Dorseys gave you? Ha! Ain't you nosy. Switch over to 27.065 megahertz. All will be revealed. Howdy, Rangers. Sorry about the clowning. Have to keep a low profile these days. Hey, this is Angela your old pal Angie, otherwise known as Ha! Somebody remembers me. 
What do you know? Figured wasn't our intent when Command sent us out here to reconnoiter. But, well, things took an unexpected turn. <sighs> I'll bet. We came out here for the same reason as you. Because Command was hoping they could make an alliance with the Patriarch and get some, uh, foreign aid. Trouble was, the more we snooped around, the more we realized that good old Pappy Buchanan was a bloody-handed dictator that the Rangers shouldn't have nothing to do with. <sighs> Unfortunately, Command didn't want to hear it. Told us they were going to make the deal anyway. Too desperate to be particular. We took a vote, the squad and me, and decided that just wasn't the Ranger way. Instead, <clears throat> we made a pact to take Buchanan down and help Colorado become the home of freedom that Arizona could have been if the Rangers hadn't lost the Citadel to Mc... Why do you think? We want you on our side, but not without seeing for your... There's a man you should talk to, locked up in an old bunker in Broadmoor Heights and guarded by Mercs. So you may have to do a little shooting to get to him, but when you do, ask him about his... His name is Ironclad Cordite, a warlord of the Eastern Plains. And one goddamn tough son of a bitch. As to how you find him, I'm a little shaky on the details, but I'm t And listen, when you do find him, bust him out of there and do what you can to keep him alive. He could help you with liberty later. Also, if you need more firepower, <laughs> shotgun he's got for a left. shotgun for a left arm. Okay. I don't reckon he would, no. But then he wouldn't approve of you talking to me, either. Gracias, compadre. Is dead red over and out. Okay. O'Leary, we said, in fact, was gonna donate this at your HQ when we got to CO Springs, but you're here, so here you go. Anyway, we ain't ate in a while. Was hoping we could trade you some things for money. To... Well, that's good to hear, Rangers. Thank you. We'll spread the word in the camps. Worse every day. Haven't seen a marshal out our way for over two years. It's like the Patriarch abandoned us. Oh, thank you. It ain't much.
kills who believes that the focus is a vicious jerk and they have the punchline. We're gonna have to put him down. Hey, thanks for the luck, Ruby and Lil Squeeze. you doing here? <laughs> Very funny. But the jokes are good. Ah! So far, so good. Damn! That hurt. It's showtime. No. Get him, clone.
run out of it. That's pretty bloody good.
Oh, work was rough. I come home, uh, I had some to eat, and then fell asleep. Uh, so I've just woken up not long ago, and it's like 9.30 almost. <sighs> Yay. <laughs> How you doing, man? Good to see you. Surprisingly, so am I. <laughs> Despite our time differences, we're we're, we're going through this together. <laughs> what do you want? You got a ticket? Not my problem. You don't got a ticket? You don't? Well, there's the ballerinas. They've been broke for a while now, and nobody knows how to fit. You did? Let me see! Let me see! <laughs> I want to be a ballerina too! <laughs> I want to be a ballerina too! You dare set foot in El Big Top? The shrine to the great joke? The blood of El Payaso Rojo stains this sacred ground. Oh, see, sí, cabrones. El Payaso <laughs> Rojo talking to his disciples him. in this very place. It goes like this. The world is dead. Mock the weak and the stupid. You. You think you can frighten me? I ask. Okay, Bell, you can do this. No, uh, that's not the one I wanted. Whoops. Okay, we're going to give it the old razzle-dazzle. See how many of these guys we can hit with our brand new rocket launcher. Boom, got him. Thanks for the redeemers, Ruby. 
I'll take care of him uh, during the enemy's turn. That worked out really well. That full cover stuff is great. Oh, got him. get the whole car. Hell yeah. This new sniper I got is absolutely insane. I did the stretch, Ruby. I just <laughs> forgot to do the hydrate. So here's the hydrate. <laughs> I'm bloody use it too. Like, I feel like seven kinds of shit at the moment. How dare you, good sir? Wild accusations with no proof. Incoming! Get him, animals.
Positioning it. A Piazza turret vehicle upgrade, 16 to 22 damage. Okay, well, killed the clown car and I got a cool car part, I guess. That would be Little Squish's territory. Increase that in like one of those books. Rolling, artifacts, automatic weapons, sneaky shit, explosives. But of course, I don't have anything for bloody.
clowns did. Fanny packs. <laughs> Okay, just a junk item. I'm like, what the hell is this? <laughs> Thank you. 
sometimes here with a happy tale of two cities. It's often difficult to get along with your neighbors, but idealism can make for strange bedfellows. In the heart of California lay a den of depravity and sin called Hollywood. The streets were rich with prostitution and dealers in drugs and alcohol. But then God's militia came and took root there. One might think that pleasures and penance of the flesh would make for incompatible neighbors. But where there are absolutes, there are also exceptions in the extremes. So it was that a dominatrix and a torturer found common ground and brought blissful peace with the unlikeliest of unions in the unlikeliest of cities. But with peace comes complacency and laziness, easily exploitable to those with a penchant for breaking, entering, and bleeding the occupants of those You know all those people I was patching up downtown? There is one man responsible for all that bloodshed. What do you need, Rangers? That's what you pay me for. Have a seat. Good old duck. Doing it for free. I won't. I never do. Please, Miss Hackett. There's no reason to get so angry. The hell they're in! My people didn't start that fight. One of your rangers started it, and now you... I'm just saying. Oh, Team November. I'm glad you're here. Nothing serious. No one was hurt. Some harsh words and a shove. Yeah, well, this isn't the first time your recruits have had harsh words. Greatski's recruitment efforts have gone well, and HQ is filling up. More new rangers every day. This is leading to friction with Miss Hackett's people, who, as you know, were there first. Usually, it's just snide comments. But today... Which is completely unacceptable behavior. But 
unfortunately. The problem's not going to go away if we ignore... There have been plenty. Most of your rangers are all right with us, but there's more than a few... Miss Hackett, I'm embarrassed. Part of the oath we take as rangers is to protect the... Yeah? What? We gotta nip this bullion in the bud. These people were here first, and we made a promise to them. Well, the warden here suggested we move into the brig. Uh, we were here first. We don't take up much space, and you... St but things have changed since then, and they're not going to change back. Shoot! You, uh, the honorable choice, Team November. I'm afraid we'll pay for this later. The refugees have my utmost sympathies, but their inability to respect the boundaries of others, particularly in such close quarters, I would say your reputation has improved dramatically. I haven't heard an impolite word about Team November in quite some time. Rangers, manners are what separates men. Let us both seek wisdom in Chapter 16, Pernicious Pleasant. So you see, Rangers, manners are critically important and a most pleasant day to you too, November. Felicitations. Hello? Uh, this is Ranger Command. Who's calling? Did you know the sun turns purple? Long enough. Uh, sir, are you all right? Uh, I ain't a roof, man! Uh, I, uh, old lady said it would improve my pro pre pre perception, so I eat it. Uh, things have been kind of funny since then. Uh, huh. Oh, boy. Okay, sir, uh, I think you need to find a nice, quiet place to lie down for a while. If things don't get better in a few hours, call me back. Rest? Uh, okay. Uh, uh, will do. We don't want these refugees ending up on the streets. I mean, that sort of desperation... Can Speaking frankly, great. Protect and serve, right? Things had grown stale with the marshals. Anytime.
Three hearts and a cot. Can't beat it. We got a, uh, we got a chef now. We'll go talk to him. Nice place they got here. It was rough there for a while. But with a little warm food in their bellies, I think everyone will calm down about the... No, not at all. There are so many wonderful people here who truly appreciate my cooking and actually chew before swallowing. There are a lot of people saying good things about the Rangers, but especially about November. Only the best ingredients for my Rangers. <laughs> it's hard to bring Colorado together with a stomach full of bitter rations. Who's that? Okay. <laughs> Rangers? What are you doing here? Well, I heard you was off in tears. Is that you, Rangers? Boy, I ain't seen you in a donkey's age. <laughs> this car. <laughs> what do you know? I ain't had a liver for. <laughs> <laughs> you're, you're drunk. <laughs> if we, you gotta cut back on the squeezes. Come on, Rangers! You know me, it's Scotchmo, your pal. I fought Cochise with you. I don't, you can't fool me with that stuff. I know who you are. What do you mean? How did I get here? I've been here the whole time. How did you get here? <laughs> <laughs> Don't mind, but I ain't here to drink. Nah, -uh. I mean, I know you rangers been going through hard times, so I'm doing my hot digging. Give me a gun and I point me at the bad guys. I I'm. <laughs> <laughs> Pardon me, just going to the latrine. By all means, go ahead. Thanks. Don't it? Jesus, everybody's so polite, it feels like I'm at a... You've been damn good to us, Rangers. No matter what happens, my people and I will stick by you. Careful out there. It's an uncaring world. Chillblains, uh, tremens, uh, who can tell?
So says the prophet. And so, let us gather the fruits of the flesh, and with our labor, create a heavenly chorus that no god can deny. Only then will we be worthy of sun and rain. Crab, please. Crab, scare. Crab, crab. Hey, morning, Kanishi. How you doing? It is it is very late in the evening for me, but I only just woke up a couple hours ago, so well like yeah. It may as well be morning for me. Executing order. <laughs> yes, it, it is quite a big difference, but, uh, you know, we make it work. <laughs> Like, uh, uh I, I got a few hours. I'll probably get another couple hours of sleep before work a little bit later on. So, fingers crossed. <laughs> Requires seven. Easy enough to understand. New gun, higher cost, unfortunate. <laughs> mm. But uh, yeah, like um, trying to stream with Brazden has been um, interesting. It's like I I've had to like we had to like hash out like what time do we both technically like are we awake? So we can play seven days. Because um, I gifted it to him, and he was like, "Hey, like I, I've never played it before." I'm like, yeah, you know, I'll I'll play it. We, we, we'll, we'll have a good time. So I was like, "Shit, uh, what what time like is available?" It's like, "Oh, hey, like I can stream like all of this day on like Monday." And I'm like, "Cool, I'll just stay awake forever." <laughs> and a good time was had by all. I, I stream, you know, like, my time, like, sort of between 5 and 6 to sort of 11 o'clock most days. I'm like, yeah, that's that's cool. Sometimes I do a little bit later or whatever, but yeah, that mon the Monday is always like, oh, okay, I've got to try and find a way to get a nap during the day so I can be up at, like, 10 or 11 and go through to, like, 6 a.m. <laughs> Worth it, though. A lot of fun. All right. Executing order.
No, 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 man. I <laughs> forgot you were here. <laughs> no, it's totally cool. Um, it, it works out perfectly. Like, Monday is the day that I can actually do that because Tuesday is my short day. I start a little bit later. It was just that last Monday I had a whole bunch of stuff that I had to do and it just didn't allow me to, like, get a much sleep at all. But, you know, as I said, I, I, I come home after work yesterday and just conked out. <laughs> or today. Yes, it's still today. It's not tomorrow yet. Ugh. I gave you a mind control gun. I haven't had a chance to use it yet because nobody's been close enough, but I'm excited to use it at some point. <laughs> I'm, I'm just glad you're having fun playing the game, and like uh, I, I quite like it. So when, when I when I you know, introduce them to it, and they're like, "This is all right," I like you know, like yes, fantastic, enjoy it or else. <laughs> I think Chomp is over by the heater there. Yeah, Chomp and Smudge are both sitting in, in the heater. They're being nice again now that Chomp's cone is off. Smudge really hated the cone. Like, almost like irrationally. <laughs> ah. Save ammo, we'll let all of the, the minions do it. You can't run from all of the the animals we've got. Sorry, bud. Good job, clone. Drool flesh. It's skinless and looks like freeze-burned meat. Look, it's even shaped like a burger patty. Hell yeah. Saves me half the effort. Yeah, I, I, I was a little bit concerned when I first brought him home and like Smudge just like tried to beat the shit out of her, like smacking her around. I'm like, like it's just a cone, like it's still the same cat Smudge, like ch calm the fuck down. <laughs> and then she chilled out a bit, but if, if uh, Chomp snuck up on her, like that was it, like. <laughs> yeah, you're gonna be alright, bird. I feel like you're going to be alright. You've got a bunch of health. You'll be fine. Yeah, here we go. Big ol' ammo stash.
Yeah, she's doing better now. Like, the first day she had a cone off, um, she, like, was licking her wound and stuff, and she obviously irritated it, and then she was, like, sucking because she'd irritated it. I'm like, well, <laughs> like, there's nothing I can do. <laughs> oh, a Pikachu. Big old robots. Oh, damn. All right. Light him up. Wow. And I thought Colorado trash was sad. You made a bad deal, Rangers. My fault. And on your way home, tell him to hire a better class of spy. My robots will turn you into a thin red mist before you get a shot off. Want to reconsider? Because he's taking too long to die of natural causes. Colorado will die before he does if someone with some vision doesn't take control ASAP. And that's not either of my brothers. Are you blind? He's letting a crazy cowboy cult control our oil production. Our main trading hub is run by a bunch of idiots and monster masts. All that should have been state-run ages ago. We... Ugh, why am I arguing policy with a bunch of gun jockeys? The point is, my... am not. Ha! I can see you haven't met him. Vic's a depraved child, and Val's a brain without a spine. I wouldn't trust either one to run a mess tent, let alone a country. To think of all the years my father wasted grooming them for glory when I was right there. God. Shoot him before he talks. You're sad not that it'll be easy getting to him. He's got his followers hooked on some kind of hypno-happy gas. They'll do anything for him, including die. The sooner he dies, the better for Colorado. He's the perfect puppet for some usurper, like the Gippers, to put on my father's throne and claim he's the legitimate heir. Of course, killing him would piss Daddy off. And you ass-kissers wouldn't want that. Might be the only way to get him out of Denver, mm. though. Those hey, Gippers good got job catching Pikachu, Kanishi. You can try it, but you'll be going back to Arizona in a bucket if you do. Fair warning. I warned you. I just want to get actually. Boys. I'm going to get slaughtered, but I, I, I want to see. Oh shit, that's a. <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> she just like took that. Four men of four people in my party in a single shot. Holy shit! <laughs> like I knew it was gonna be bad, but oh my god! And they didn't even have a turn yet. <laughs> All right, Warbot, fuck me up. Sick. Oh my god. <laughs> wow. Okay. <laughs> Arizona, 
Colorado on the train. Wow. Um. I okay, guess so that's definitely like a, a fight that you're not supposed to engage in. <laughs> like, there's no way you can get strong enough to, to deal that much damage before you just get immediately wiped out. Hard times in Arizona with the rangers and the settlers giving ground. See the raiders and militia. And it seems we lose the good life that we found. <laughs> then you can made us off to find my kids and I will help you save your land. So we rode for Colorado, praying that he'd be an honest man. <laughs> yeah, Rance, my mother let her father live taking him with her in a wheeled cage so he could see the ruin of everything built. She marched her army north and south until all of Colorado groveled at her feet. Without any of Colorado, the Rangers of Arizona struggled to survive. At last, General Woodson ordered them to pull up roots and move on. Nobody knows where they went. <laughs> with that, the story of Team November comes to an end. For good or ill, you change Colorado forever and its people will live with the consequences. But the story of the Rangers goes on. <laughs> okay, so we actually got a... That was a legitimate ending of just attempting to arrest her and get absolutely fucking destroyed. I like that. I like At least I'll know this time not to do it. <laughs> Colorado trash was sad. You made a bad deal, Rangers. My father's using you for cannon fodder. Go back to Arizona before you take a bullet for him. The graves are cold up here. And on your way home, tell him to hire a better class of spy. Spoken like a true lap dog. Because he's taking too long to die of natural causes. Colorado will die before he does if someone with some vision doesn't take control ASAP. And that's not either of my brothers. Ugh, and not. To think of all the years my father wasted grooming them for glory when I was right there. God. Not that it'll be easy getting to him. Of course, killing him would piss Daddy off. And you ass-kissers wouldn't want that. Might be the only way to get him out of Denver, though. Those Gippers got their hooks in him deep. You can try it, but you'll be going back to Eric. I'm counting on it. Squad, roll out! <laughs> can I get a couple of murder bots?
servant of death by his own pride and ignorance. Optimism may make you many friends, but pessimism can keep you alive. Deep in the south of Arizona, a farmer named Oliver awoke one morning to find his crops had grown to ginormous sizes. Melons the size of a prize heifer. Cucumbers that would put any man to shame. Believing that God had touched his ranch, the farmer in... Executing order.
Executing order. What are e necklaces? <laughs> Surprisingly, a large amount of cash, too. Alright, let's go find out where the chest is, because there's usually a chest on the map with some supplies. Dev, uh, Kitty is good. She's um, got her sutures out. She's got her cone off. She was in a bit of distress yesterday just because, like, that was the first day that she could sort of um, reach the wound and stuff. So she obviously aggravated it a little bit just by, you know, trying to clean it up and whatever. But she's doing better now. And uh, I'm not doing too bad. I'm feeling rough because that was my. It was my first day, uh, first full day of work today. Or well, anyway, it was a short day, but it's still my, you know, I still managed to get through the whole day. But I am feeling sore, so I come home and I just sort of fell asleep and had a nap. Woke up, and just uh, back at it. <laughs> just playing some Wasteland 3 and chilling out. How are you doing? Heed the words of the prophet, brothers and 
sisters. Make your kites strong, so the offerings they bear will reach the heavens above. Take you the supple skin of the sacrifice. Carve it in a single piece from belly and back. Ranger Command calling Team November. Ah, uh, got something strange for you. Don't know if it's a hoax or a trap or what, but I thought you should hear it. Up to you if you want to respond. Hey, is that a... Signal originates near your current location. All right, cool, thanks for that. Anyway, I'll patch you through. Yeah, I dropped it a little bit. Chomp chomp. Coming to say you hello? All right. Oh, you're all sleepy and warm because you're in front of the heater. Oh. <laughs> Your little shaved belly is warm too. <laughs> we certainly are safe scumming this game. Uh, simply because, uh, yes, as you said, a very RNG game. And I, I, I'm using it. I don't really sort of plan on playing through it multiple times, so I'm... Uh, sometimes I'm just saving and loading just so I can try out different dialogues and stuff. Ugh, interest rate rises again. Uh. Uh, they should fucking, s you know, can we, can we, can we stop that? <laughs> hey, no worries, Roby. Thank you very much for the hydrate and the stretch. Kitty, you want to stretch with me? Nope. Okay. Ugh. Like we, uh, Zabba, we just got an ending, um, for the game where we failed, uh, wonderfully. Um, I don't know if you ever made it to the point where you try to sort of head out more, but Liberty turned up and she was like, hey, you guys are a bunch of shitbags. I'm going to kill my dad and take over the, you know, Colorado. Um, you send him a message, he's a fuckhead. And I'm like, we're going to stop you. And she's like, you realize, you realize I've got these two giant railgun-wielding murder robots behind me, right? Like, and I was like, I was like, alright, look, we did literally save before this. I've got to try and take her down now. Like, I know that the game, it's this is clearly going to be an unwinnable fight, but I want to see what happens. I was like, no, we can't let you go. We're going to arrest you. She killed four of my people in a single shot with some sort of, like, railgun that just ripped through in a straight line. Um, <laughs> it's like, I didn't even get a turn to start with. Like, she got his first turn and she just took out four of my party. Um, only, well, no, it was five because only one of my people was up. Um, the robots didn't even have a turn either. It was just her. Then all my little, like, friendly allies ran up to try and take her down. Uh, yeah, they have thousands of health. Like, it's, like, it's very deliberately constructed to be just impossible. Uh, <laughs> so I did, like, you know, a hundred damage because all of my dudes were dead, so it was all, like, just the, the, the animals and the companions just going up and taking a few pot shots. Um... <laughs> And then on their turn, the robot, one of like the the robots were hitting my uh, allies for sixteen hundred damage a shot, and they had like four shots each, and they just completely eviscerated anything left standing. I was like, oh yeah, that's that's definitely a fight that you're not supposed to win. I am. <laughs> well, I hesitate to go into detail, even on a secure channel. Let's just say I serve America. So we just sort of, we and it, and it actually gave us like an ending clip and showed us that like she, Liberty came through and just took control, uh, enslaved her father in like a, a wheeled cage so she could take him around the countryside watching her just destroy everything he'd built. And then the rangers got no help because I'd failed so they had to like move on and nobody knows where they went. I'm like, oh man, this is not a great ending, is it? <laughs> While on assignment, I became trapped in an old military facility near Denver. 
I cannot disable the facility security from within. That's not important. What is important is that you can free me. Now will you help or not? Thank you. This is a matter of life and death for me. I appreciate your concern. Hey, chomp chomp. <laughs> uh, your little shaved belly is cute. And it's really, really warm. I'm gonna pat it. <laughs> if you can find Denver's Union Station, then I can guide you the rest of the way. Morningstar, out. I don't know who you are, Morningstar. But we're gonna see if we can help you. Some radiation that way. Just gonna skirt around all that radiation, because fuck that. Although it did give me a third eye, so I can't complain too much. I've Unparalleled depth perception. A fantastic. Uh, okay. Investigate the supplies. Ooh. Oh, more radiation. Items out of that. Uh, how are you feeling, Car? Unable to process. Please repeat <laughs> query. Never mind. Hey, JJ, how you doing? Do we have any extra radiation things? Because I've accidentally hit radiation. Yeah, so a third eye, which is critical chance plus five percent. Really helps. Oh. Yeah. I don't want to use a no glow because it'll remove my bonus like good bonus, but we we're gonna go. Actually, no, I don't. Uh, I probably should have just did the the manual save was my recent one. I want to keep my crit. <laughs> don't want to. Don't want to take the negative ten percent to hit though. It's hard enough to bloody hit them as it is. As Zabo said, this game is really, really uh, RNG sort of uh, dependent. And whilst I I don't like particularly hate that, at the same time, I kind of fucking hate it. <laughs> But I mean, it, this is a game that doesn't like punish you for saving. Like, there's no real downside to it. So I'm I'm okay with it simply because, you know, you can save it as many times as you want. Like, uh, Kingdom Come Deliverance uh, has you like spend stuff to save. So if it, it, if that game was a lot more um, RNG dependent, I'd be really sort of annoyed. <laughs> Alright, what do you got there? Why can't I? There we go. Oh no, lame leg? It is lame. And that's just the buff from having Billie Jean as my party member. Twisted wrist? Ugh. Man, getting down sucks. Flesh pocket. <laughs> that is that's fucking disturbing I, I where where is the flesh pocket is it just <laughs> you just have a flesh pocket <laughs> oh okay you know that, that's a cool little mutation I'm, I'm keeping it <laughs> Blue! What are you doing here watching some squash? 
<laughs> you know what, we're just gonna, we're gonna head back and get ourselves that radiation protection for our Kodiak so that we don't, don't have to worry about picking up any other negative uh, traits. I've got my, my extra crit trait, I want to keep that. <laughs> I'm sure I'll get a chance to pick some up, extra ones up later on down the line. Unable to process. Please repeat query. Never mind. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Squash. I, I, I agree, Zeb. Like, as, like, sim since there's no penalty for pausing, they give you a ton of, like, save slots. There's an auto-save feature, a quick-save feature. There's a whole lot of ways for you to, to deal with the RNG if you want to. And I really like that, you know. Rangers. Name's BB Gun. Glad to meet you. Hey, you guys been really getting the job done, but listen. We've been doing a little civil forfeiture, and we need to turn some impound into Hey, cash. Rev, I'm good. How are you? And before you answer, here's a free sample for being such a friend to the marshals. Now, you want to see the rest? Aw, oh, thanks. I'll tell the others you said so. Huh? Oh, yeah! Guilty as hell! <laughs> Trust me. Every one of Yay! Yeah. Thank you very much, Rip. You did not have to do that, but it is greatly appreciated. And now I have to go ahead and drop the price of crabs. So give me a moment while I do that. And. Oh no, work! Ah! I will commiserate with you. Look at look at us, we're commiserating. I also don't want to go to your work, so I won't. But unfortunately I have to go to mine. Lame But yeah, not for a little while. Alright. Points crab has been dropped. Yeah. <laughs> Crabs, please. Crab, 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 Straight onto the crabs. Well, look, uh, fingers crossed for you, and I hope that you get the results that you desire. <laughs> Whatever that may be. No judge. No judge. Uh, I, I've, I've had it twice, and it fucking sucked both times, but, uh, Little squish had it a little while back, and I, I, I dodged that bullet. I was very lucky to not get it a bloody third time. I, ha I have to imagine that getting it the second time helped protect me from the third one, because uh, she didn't get it from me either, so, you know. <laughs> I think she went away for an appointment, and the next town over, come back, and then got sick. It's like, ah, oh, shit. <laughs> So. I mean, at least it, uh, I wouldn't have minded getting it if it was, you know, if I could have had it when I hurt myself, because then 
you know, work isn't out extra time, I'm not out extra leave just to, you know, recover, but... Same, on the, at the same time, it sucks. <laughs> People are all like, oh, I wish I had it so I could have time off work. No, no, no. If you're going to have time off work, you want to be able to do something. <laughs> it sucks both times I had it. <laughs> Citizens of Colorado, this is your patriarch speaking. Flame of liberty burns bright in our fair state, but not without help from you. If you would protect. Fucking Dorseys. <laughs> they done killed my friends and my peoples. And now I'm going to kill every last one of them, because fuck him. Yeah, honestly, um, I, I I do as well, just because I work in retail, um, so I, I usually test twice a week, which fucking costs me a fortune. But at the same time, uh, I'm not going to be the one to kill fucking somebody with COVID, you know. Yeah, got a new weapon on the... I, I went and killed all the clowns and I destroyed their clown car and it let me take their uh, their weapon, which does... It did slightly more damage than the base one, but it shoots 20 times instead of 10, so I was like, hmm, okay, I can't really... I mean, I, don't, I think it looks dumb as hell, but at the same time, I can't say no to over double the damage, so I guess I'm using the fucking stupid clown minigun. So I kind of hate myself, but at the same time, like, it's just too strong. I, I know. And I, I, uh, did you ever play number two, Zabo? I, I was a, um, a backer for it, and I got it, like, in the little ed limited edition, like, ammo case thing, and I really, really liked it. So, I, I, I... I understand this game's got that that certain vibe, but goddamn, <laughs> damn clown car. Although I, I do enjoy the the clowns uh, as like a a bunch of bad guys, like that's their their gang of evil clowns. So I get it. It's a little doggy. Out, it's time for the deluge. I also have a clone of myself who just runs around throwing uppercuts. Fucking love him. He's like, he's like the son I never had, and and occasionally he says a word, cause he's the smarts. 
And yeah, I've got the parrot. <laughs> uh, I want the good news, Reb. Wait, no. Give me no. Give me the bad news because then I'll be able to commiserate with you, and then we'll both celebrate your good news. And again, thank you very much for the sub. Uh, it, it is greatly appreciated. And you know, it's September, so we all we all cool. Right, go on and tame the doggy. Hey, doggy, you're my friend now. Aha! Got him. Can we take out that fucking sniper? No. But you know what we can do? We can move forward one. Can we? Can we? Yes. Fuck him up. don't have enough for that, but what I do have is enough for using my new mortar. Woo! Now nobody can walk in that area because the owies of the feet. Ah, well that's terrible, terrible news. You, you, want, you want to give us some good good news? Yeah, you do. Give us, give us that good news. I am here for your good news. Just fucking hit me with it. Oh, fantastic. I am super glad that you're healthy. You know, I, uh, I, I, I definitely, definitely wasn't hoping that you'd get uh, to chill out and have some time off. Um, no, it's all about your health. That's, that's it. <laughs> mm hmm Yeah. <laughs> So are you, are you ready for work now, or is it something you have to do sort of shortly? You sure you just can't stay forever? <laughs> well, look, an hour, an hour is still, you know, time to sort of hang and be, like, cool. I appreciate you being here and hanging out.
Go get him. Goose, stop. <laughs> goose, goose, duck. Good clone. Yeah, I can the old haymaker. Awaiting orders. Fuck him up, truck. Installment on the farm. I'm a little bit annoyed that the time doesn't pause whilst you're doing this. to quick load that's fucking sure yeah yeah I, I recruited him and uh, I was like one of the op so I went to check on him and he's like I'm like I could ask him to clone I'm like do I want to do this and um, I'm like sure you know I thought it would just like give me a ranger recruit or something and then he come out and he's all like not all there and I'm like oh he a bad clone It's not even the or even the auto save. They didn't auto save before that fight. Damn it! Oh. quest I had. That's right, I've got to go back to the town and talk. So, perfect! <laughs> but yeah, now my cl like, I'm like, oh, can I like give him equipment or anything? I'm like, nope, he just runs around naked, swinging his fists, and then I see him like start if if he starts the turn next to somebody, he like swings at, at least th I think three times. I've, I've seen him swing, and he hurts. I'm like, okay, damn, this clone guy's not bad. <laughs> but then I've now I've got a couple of animal companions. I've got Billy and Jean, the two-headed goat. Um, I've got the parrot. I've got Major Tom. I could have a weight like a a waste a waste wolf, but. You know, I'm, I'm enjoying having uh, the the pets that I do. <laughs> you ever hear of car gardens? You mean where they grow these fine automobiles for our personal use? So I don't want to get, get rid of them, cute. but <laughs> Sorry. it does require then, a reasonably high level to tame. So I'm like, I kind of want to give him a go. go down to this old man's farm. He said he had a few Didn't expect was 50 VWs in his garden. All right, Mama Carter. Hell do you want from Mama Carter? Maybe so. Where are those refugees now? Shit. I knew I shouldn't have trusted those assholes, but they were the only ones who deal with me. Guess I... <laughs> I owe you for keeping those refugees safe. Ain't nobody... So, uh, what's it gonna be, hmm? 
You know I was breaking the city's law, conspiring with smugglers and all that. You gonna haul me in? Ooh. Well, it, it's starting to look like, basically, the, the, the choices that it keeps throwing at me is basically help the city or help everybody else. And I'm like, ah, oh, like, Sure. Man, so these some of these choices are rough. <laughs> Stand down, Bobby. These are the same folks who shot up the door season the Garden of the Gods. This ain't with the lives of my boys. I'll go quietly. Copy, November 1. This is Ranger HQ. What's your status? Old Mama Cotter. A criminal? Who would have thought? Dispatching a squad. Over and out. Uh, no, no. We, you know what? I'm just gonna tell her, like, stop smuggling people in. I don't feel feel good about it. <laughs> I'm like, oh, the, the the expedient thing to do would be to arrest her for breaking the law, and then I'm like, uh, immediately, like, oh man, like, uh, I feel bad. you want from Mama Carter? Maybe so. Where are those refugees now? Shit. <laughs> I owe you. So, uh, what's it gonna be, hmm? You know I was breaking the city's law, conspiring with smugglers and all that. You don't know Mama so well. She ain't gonna stop helping those folks no matter what anyone says. Damn it! <laughs> Uh, you know, we'll just, we'll, we'll side with the refugees at this point. That's good. Real good. I'll start looking for... You mean we'll start... No. I'm sending three of you boys to work for these rangers. You're damn good at fixing cars. I want you to help out around their garage. Whatever orders they give you, follow them. They're fine people, and we owe them. About time we got some mechanics at the... B and you rangers, take care of my boys. They're better mechanics than they are conversationalists. <laughs> and they'll keep your trucks roaring like mountain lions. Hope they'll be a big help to you. 
Bobby, Jesse, Jimmy, gather up your things. You're working for the Rangers now. Okay, that's works for me, but uh, man, like, oh. <laughs> the guy's gonna be pissed when I go and tell him. Oh well. November, this is Ranger HQ. A couple vehicles rolled up and set up right outside our base. Real shady characters. Their leader is a woman named La Perla, who claims to have business with the Rangers, but won't specify. Copy that, November. We'll have them hold outside until you return. Over and out. Ranger HQ. I have good news. There's some new gear here next time you stop by. It's a big improvement over the basic stuff we had before. But one last thing. The Patriarch commissioned a sculptor to make a statue of Vargas outside our HQ. He's nearly done, but he'd like to know who we want to dedicate this statue. Good call, November. Making sure the Rangers know they'll be remembered if the worst comes to pass may boost camaraderie. That makes sense. Makes sense. Also, is a little squish. Get halfway to another level for little squish. Watch yourselves. You don't belong here, Rangers. Go home. Oh, damn. I heard Mr. Howe found himself a pretty blonde thing. I heard you were speaking to some people at the refugee camp. Do you have any news? I can't say I'm not disappointed. You may think you're helping the refugees, but you're not. If they keep good day to you. Our business is done, Rangers. I wish nothing. She's been too busy with the pool boy. Okay. Ugh. Sounds like I'm gonna have another thief 
choice to make. straight with you so far, right? Didn't I tell you the truth about McTavish? Don't I always tell you the truth? Come on, Red Hats, it's me, your old buddy, Charlie. Really now, Red Hats, what's the point of saying no to... When you inevitably come to the conclusion that the answer should have been yes, you can find us in a hideout near the old parking lot, outside the bazaar. We'll be waiting. I mean, we just helped the monster the army. Reyes, <laughs> are to blame. Hey. Thanks, but, like, leave us alone now, okay? Um, yeah. A little privacy? Jeez. Okay. Conspiracy unmasked. Rangers I know. Like, I've been to the bazaar. I just helped them. I killed all the weird clown people for them. The the and, Colorado you know... Country. They didn't try to, like, stab me in the back. They, like, Flab was actually a really, like, sort of cool dude in regards to treating how he treated us. So, you know, I, I, I kind of want to be straight with him because Charlie's a fucking dickhead and lied to us constantly. So, you know. <clears throat> some business for you if you have the full all right let's see who the fuck these people are what they want <laughs> peace strangers we all know both sides a girl I own ran away recently and it's proving harder than expected on the other hand she'd never suspect <laughs> Hell with your reputation for rest. <laughs> that bothers you? You find it unethical? You kill crazy corpse robbing, tyrant funded gun jockeys are offended at how I. Sorry, compadres. This is the end times. Nothing but. I'm La Perla. And these are my boys. Nelly. No. Hallie, I think. Anyway, her new owner will rename her. Early twenties, blonde, shapely, skin like a princess. You'll know. You can't see. No, no. You know the sealed rooms in your base? Bueno, I'll tell you for free. It's old world tech. The kind people waged war. You'll get the second code. The one that gets you into the room with the even better goodies. When you bring me... Uh. 
to stay here all the time before we moved east. Had plenty of time to explore all its nooks and crannies. Hey, don't worry. No hard feelings about you taking it over. We like our new home on the plains. Those were not these slaves. Yeah, get ready. No slave. Holy shit. <laughs> uh, so what we're gonna do... Got him with the mind control beam. No slave is here.
We're gonna fight, we need to make sure we're in a better position. <laughs> I didn't realize it was the, the smiling lady, the, the slavers that they talked they've talked about him.
got some business for you. If you have the cojones. Hola, Rangers. <laughs> A girl on the other. <laughs> Sorry, compadres. I are my boys. Nelly. Early twenties. Blonde. Shapely. You. No. You know the. Bueno. You'll get the second call. The one that gets you into the room with the even better goodies. Not these. Ah. You can handle this. Right? See if this one works out better for us. Yeah, exactly, Reb. Hey, Vark, how you doing? Hope you're having a lovely day. None shall leave on tree. Holy shit! You will These guys are rough. Probably should have thrown the uh, the old decoy out first. So yeah, I'll, I'll have to use a few decoys because that that shot was insane. Like did so much damage. <laughs> I mean, not as much as the bloody giant robots that did 1600 bloody damage. Girl, on the 
on the sorry compadres are my boys early 20s blonde no you know the bueno you'll get the second code the one that gets you into the room with the even not these sleepers. so rather than using elusive off the bat for the machine gun we're gonna throw a couple of decoys i think get Brasden to again because they have so much armor that if I can't get some of them to fight each other we're not winning that fight which I, I wish I wish we could but <laughs> Wow. If you have the cojones. Hola, Rangers. We need a couple of decoys and we need to, um... <laughs> a girl. Mind control a couple of them for a turn or two. And then we should hopefully be good. <laughs> Hell with your reputation for rescuing little lost lambs. Sorry, compadres. This is the end time. I'm la... Are my boys. Ne Early 20s. <laughs> you know... Bueno, you'll get the second code. The one that gets you into the room with the even... Better goodies. When you... Not these slavers, you don't. We're in it now. Smudge, how you doing? <laughs> Alrighty. Come on, Bresden, I believe in you. Time for mind control gun. No, we need... We're gonna need both of them. It's alright. There's a good chance we'll get both of them again. <laughs> I could just leave them sitting there for a while, but I, I kind of want to like just get rid of them. I don't, I don't like. You know, I'm trying to play the good guys. Slave of bad. Gonies. Uh, I just think that. A girl. Yeah. On the other I'm the Rangers. I'm, Sorry, I'm the good guys. Slavery bad. If I was playing bad guys, I'd, I'd be down. But. You know the sealed rooms. In bueno, you'll get the second code. The one that gets you into the room with the even. Not these slavers. You don't.
Come on, mind control gun. We don't need to get that guy in the back, but I need La Perla and the Enforcer. Come on. You did too. You gave it to me a couple of times while I was learning the bloody fight. <laughs> it's playing hard to get now. Reputation for rescuing little lost lambs. Sorry, compadre. I'm are my boy. Early twenties, blonde, shapely, skin like a princess. You'll know her when you see her. I promise you. She'll make your little hearts go peter pat. <laughs> Take it easy, farm girl. You know the bueno, you'll get the second code. The one that gets you into the room with the even better goodies. When you bring me my lost, you used to pray, don't worry. No hard feelings about you taking it over. We like our new home. Not these slavers, you don't. <laughs> Come on, Brazden. Counting on you, bud. You can do this. Really? Neither one of them? Alright. Uh, I mean, I, I might be able to do it if I drop enough decoys and turrets, but... I'd rather just save scum it. <laughs> Second code, the one that gets you into the room with the even better goodies. When you bring chasing down a pr far as I know, she still s will be here. All right, if I quick save now, I at least get past most of the conversation bullshit I have to do. Do we have a deal? Spotted. Kinda wish my car would fight with me, but he's in the garage. Lazy bastard. Here we go.
know, they took out the two decoys. Oh! My aim's dead off. Thousand damage. <laughs> Fucking hell. <laughs> Let's throw another decoy out there because the last one's worked really, really well. <laughs> Missed it, really? Come on. We'll set this right. Take cover. Well, fuck get him. Get him, clone. Just fuck beat the shit out of him. <laughs> No worries, Ramp. Enjoy your shower. Enjoy your work. You gotta do what you gotta do, right?
course they had to reload. <laughs> Get him. Really? You missed every fucking sh- oh my god. Uh, fine, you missed every single shot, whatever. Thank you, turret.
that we can't catch that Pokemon. Get them all. Yay. I don't know what fracture is, but we're going to find out. Two. You're making it real, huh? <laughs> it, it, it doesn't count as shooting them. <laughs> Finally. Ooh, one of them had a flamethrower. Oh yeah, the 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 brother. Team November.
I know it's a tight fit with the refugees, but there's always enough room to do the right thing. Speaking frankly, great. Protect and serve, right? Things had grown stale with the mark any time. All right, now let's go upgrade the car. When all this is over, we send them savages back to Kansas where they belong. Hey now, Rangers. It's good to see you. Y'all got a nice place here. Thank you. We uh, we take good care of it. Can't complain. There's a lot of space here. Lots of room for growth. If we work at it, this is gonna be one hell of a place. Might even be able to build some lofted bedrooms over the garage. Move mom over here. We'll see. Just setting up right now. I hope you don't mind the fact that we've added our own little touches to the place. Actually, as you know, Mama won't let Tommy come with us on account of the fact that he's her favorite. Unfortunately, that's left us a bit shorthanded. Anyway, I heard stories about a genius mechanic up in the bazaar, so if you ever find yourself out there, knew we could count on you, Rangers. Knew we could count on you, Rangers. Why, well, sure. Ain't nothing I can do for you. You got to talk to Bobby. That chicken's got some machine to parts. Who would do that? <laughs> Y'all take care now. That's a mighty fine question, my dude. Who would? Know who I hate the most? Who? The fucking hundred families. All we do is take care of those rich motherfuckers. And do they thank us? Fuck no, they don't. Are you crazy talking that way? Somebody's gonna hear you. I don't care. We fucking kippers. How do they have our oil buried under their land? You know, if Daisy would just let us off our chain for once, it would be our land. Those pretend cowboys wouldn't stand a chance against the real thing. 
Us marshals would squeeze the oil out of them until they hollered uncle. I'd rather have more mouths to feed than dead people. It's fine. Can't complain. Later, Rangers. We're here to help the people, dudes. Don't worry. We got it. Let's see if there's any other way to actually get We can't get the good stuff because we didn't side with the slavers, but we can get the complimentary prize. You know what? I'm, I'm happy just gonna... I don't get all the goodies in that last room, but... You know what? Fuck slavers. <laughs> We're the good guys right now. Actually, I should get the Dr. Patrick. So, I'm gonna take a quick bye break. I'll grab something to eat and drink. Uh... It's a weird time right now, and uh, I will return shortly.
nice little bio break, a bit of a walk around to make sure I was still waking up. And now, I have some delicious sandwiches and some anti inflammatories to take. <laughs> Ooh, painkillers and stuff. <laughs> So just give me a minute to organize that. It won't take me long. And we'll be back into the thick of it. Darius Chomp. What do you need, Rangers? I'll do what I can. Have a seat. I won't. I never do. You know what? Next time we go see Mama, I'm gonna bake her an apple pie. What do you, you know anything. about bacon Bobby's the one to talk to. <laughs> You're just gonna embarrass yourself. Let's get some. I know that. We're gonna go back to the clown place and uh, get that box.
made it. Thanks for helping out the old Get family. Homestead is right up the Any luck, Rangers? Can't thank you enough for looking out for my family. This man's been torn apart. Oh, look. Wolverine tracks. Trouble uh, here.
She's crazy, she's crazy, she's eating everyone.
Ah! 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 Thank you. 
dreams for my brother. He's real nice. Randy, do you want some of these? They're my very last ones. The gummies say it's okay to chew on them. It's respectful. And they taste so sweet. Oh well, it's okay. More candies for Anita. Don't shout at me! I'll come, I'll come! You won't melt like mommy and daddy, right? I didn't like it. Except for the jump ropes they made me. That was okay. I okay. I don't know why you're so mean to me, but okay. Just don't hurt me. Is that you? I don't know how to thank you, Rangers. My, my little sister, safe and sound and all in one piece, but... but wait, what about everyone else? Oh, hell. I was afraid you were gonna say that. Hey, but thank you again, Rangers. Once I get her settled in, I'll come over to your base. I can't believe you brought Nita back to me, Rangers. Hey, say thanks, Nita. My brother's dreams are sorted. I can't believe you brought Nita back to me, Rangers. Hey, say thanks, Nita. Randy, my brother's dreams are sorted. Got any can? Can't believe you brought Nita back to me, Rangers. Hey, say thanks, Nita. Yeah, my brother's that's dreams uh... are sorted. Got any can? Oh, that's awkward. <laughs> See what else but we can the toil do. Has been worth it. Colorado is the envy of all its neighbors. Enjoy it. Bringing it to
Titan Shooter here with another episode of Monster Gun Mods. I know it's been a while since I did an update on the Napalm Cannon build. Those burns I got last episode took a long time to heal, bro. But while I was waiting for the skin grafts to set, I got an idea for an even more radical build. You heard of nail guns, right? Well, I'm gonna build a nail mini gun. That's right. <laughs> Stay tuned. Just sit tight, November. Help's coming. Wait, no, I can go to the monster thingies and um, tell them that somebody wants to take over the bazaar. Got it. Damn it.
one alive can remember what it was like before the war. But my parents remembered, and they filled me with stories of how it used to be. Those memories became my... <laughs> You're the Patriarch's new hires, right? The Desert Rangers. Got some stuff to train if you want to look. Well, I ain't the best mechanic in Colorado, but how can I say no after a maintain your vehicle and don't stop if you have just some odds and ends I've taken in trade? Might be useful.
Guns. Sanctified. Boss man is someone's uh, sanctified with blood. Trying to take over. Sanctified by guns. True? We had crazy clowns roaming the warrants? Unbelievable. Yeah. Thank you for your help. Thank you for your help. I welcome you to my house. Make yourself comfortable. My hospital Andy, the mechanic, yes. He is a genius. So young, but my friends, it is good that you understand respect. Such courtesy is so lacking these days. <laughs> Thank you for letting me know with that uncontinue. Charlie, yes, I know of him. The tongue of a chest. I thank you for showing this loyalty to the bazaar. Here is a small sum, but this is on the bazaar. We'll be waiting. If you're looking for guns, the sanctified Piscatel has the best. Piscatelli has the best. Huh? Stay away from that safe, lambs. The monster army has been around for a while. Flab's always going on about the olden days. Doc says I got the pot. Dr. Cold Cuts! Dr. Cold Cuts! Can you we should get something hot yet. to drink for the trip home. Really need to ask Piscatelli to look at my gun. Ah, bugger keeps jamming. Let me just make sure the refugees are gone.
Hello, elusive. Welcome, and thank you for the biddies. A privilege and pleasure as always. <laughs> hey -o. Red Hats! I knew you couldn't refuse such a good opportunity. Didn't I tell you they'd come around sooner or later, men? So, it's brilliant in its simplicity. The monster arm, first we take the entrance, then we go down and wipe out anyone who doesn't surrender to the nuke. Is that so, Red Hats? Shame it has to come. No! Okay, Bell, Boys, you can do this! Get him! In the, in the front, so we can try the mind control uh, game, uh, gun again. I'm good. I slept for a bit before. Now I'm just floating around, playing some games. How about yourself? throw it inside. Well, you know what? I'm glad. Did you did you get to sleep all right though? Fine. I hope you got some of yourself earlier.
out and had interesting dreams. Whoa! You cleaned out both, both of them? No, you didn't clean out it. You just put a debuff on them. then I am super, super happy that you had a great sleep. Alright, get in there and get them, animals. And crystal, okay, I'll take it. A light squad weapon, hell yeah. Okay, Ken's a shriveled junk. Oh, he yeah, adds from Kendall. Yeah, that's a really weird item. nerd stuff person. No worries. I very much appreciate the look. Glad you had sleep and, you know, doing your adulting and stuff with the kitties off to school. And I appreciate the biddies and the lurk and the chats.
Okay, that's pretty cool. Plus one armor and, and a big old healing bonus. Okay, looks like that's the only real lootable thing in here. Okay. a good time. Oh no. We should get something hot to drink for the trip home. Got the cold cut. Yo, what else, yeah? Check out Warwick's museum. I welcome you to my house. Make yourself comfortable. Stimulated with the correct amount of prejudice, I hope. Thank you, Rangers. Here, the bazaar will be waiting. Yes. What do you think of the mask? Doctor Cold Cut. We should get some hot to drink for the trip home. Really need to ask Piscatelli to look at my gun. Ah, bugger keeps jamming. <laughs>
Springs Gaming Club wants you. We play Robots and Rangers every Tuesday night, and we're looking for a few heroes to join our party. We've got the rules and the dice. All we need is your imagination. Oh, and snacks. This is Ranger Control, signing off. Hey now, it's the Desert Rangers again. You all are buttering me up one side and down the... One of our caravans got hit last week. So long, Rangers. Why did Mama send us here and let Tommy stay behind? Because Tommy's Mama's favorite. That ain't true, is it? Why? Maybe because he looks most like Pa? He does at that. Jimmy's got Pa's heart, I got his brawn, Jesse's got his brains. His looks had to go somewhere. What's the matter? You don't like working it? I like it fine. I just miss Pa. We all do, boy. You brought my candy. Mama says we owe these. Folks. I'm gonna have some later. We're gonna have the best asleep. as we can. Don't tell mommy. Mama always knows what's right.
never got a chance to thank you properly for saving Nita. I don't know what I would have done. I was thinking on how I could show my thanks and realized I work with cars day in and out. And you all take them into battle. There's a lot of things I learned about how to fix cars. Happy to be here. I've already been working with your folks here. They'll have all kinds of new... See you around. If there's something you need, you come to me. What? Well, sure. All right, we got a level. We got a level two chassis, straight up.
We are doing good. cartoon in there when Jeffy ripped a robo arm off that scar collector and cracked up. I was gonna ask about the articles, but never mind. Oh, you again. What do you want? How do you know my name? They're, they're gone? <laughs> Thank you. Oh, I hope I can find a way to repay you. Rather freeze to death or burn. You're a barrel of monkeys, huh? Now, come on. Nice to see the city back to life, huh? Yeah, people. What do you need, Rangers? I like you, Rangers, but a girl needs to be sure before she commits. If you know what's on your mind. Roger that. Right. Let's go to Broadmoor Heights to see if those uh that Rangers Club D and D shit's happening because they shouldn't be on the radio. Rangers. No comment on refugee scandal. I have nothing to say to you, Rangers. My family 
will be avenged. old enough to be his grandmother. Love's love, and a lavish inheritance is a lavish inheritance. Tourists. Oh, Melissa, you can too much. Oh, oh, we're just talking, Rangers. Pay us no mind. <laughs> what could you possibly want? You again. How boring. You, you again. You again. How boring. This beastly weather, I can smell them from here. Absolutely repugnant, Sal. Repugnant. I suppose they'll let just anyone in these days. Indeed, Melissa. Simply any. Hmm? Yes. Oh, <laughs> hello. I'm Diligent Joe, uh, the Patriarch's personal secretary. I make sure uh, only people who have official business with... Of course, uh, that privilege... Hello, Joe. Ah, Miss Wesson. Thank you, Joe. Uh, it used to be that we held town hall meetings where citizens could bring their grievances before him, but, uh... Good day! Rangers! Rangers!
This palace used to be a fancy hotel back before the deluge. Wonder if they had the turret guns back then. You're cleared for public areas only. Stop! Okay. Good to see you, Rangers. The Patriarch likes it quiet in here. So do we. Cyclops. My family and I were invited to dine with the Patriarch a while ago. Seemed a bit sad at that table, all by his lonesome. Genuine pairs of footwear spin with genuine Stop! Only members of the Patriarch's family are allowed back here. Okay, so this is one left. Uh, one place to actually go. Rangers, welcome. How are you settling in? Not at all. Now, what can I do for you? Tell me. Fine. Ask then. Used to be my strongest supporters. Until we had an argument about how quickly democracy should... Until they attacked the city, I thought I'd wiped out the whole family. 
Apparently, Neelius led some of them into the wilderness. I assume it was Liberty who put them up to the raid. They were never this clever before. Fine. Before you go, where the hell were you when that Arapaho caravan was wiped out? When I give you an order, Ranger. Now get going, and come back with results. Used to get lots of visitors, not anymore. Hey, you hear about Rosalind's ex? Uh, the love puzzle guy? Scuttlebutt is he's been trying to get rotated into her unit. <laughs> oh, we gotta make this happen. You, you ever see Roz go all Ice Queen on some poor soul? It's like, I know we're on break, but keep your voice down. sudden moves, understand? Automated duty roster change. New assignments are... Automated duty roster change. Clean your mess. Anyone live here? All right, where's my toaster person? This is about what I expected. Oh, 
Wow. Robot Love Magazine. Of course, I first with Ronald Reagan. <laughs> Is that a, a gun? Fantastic. I've never been this tidy in my life. Hello, how you doing? He knows gaming. Thank you very much for the follow. I hope you're having a good day. We're just mucking about with some Wasteland 3. How are you doing today? Rangers. Oh, Lord. Do it like 
for the patriarch of the Sumner family. It's like watching the evolution of man in reverse. I don't believe we were having a conversation. I'd certainly remember that. How did you get that? I... Hand over those documents. In return, I'll use my considerable influence to ensure you are well known and fondly thought of among respectable sorts of people. My people. Hmm. What? I... Well, thank you. You really aren't from around here. How refreshing. I just... I don't think I had anything left to do in this place. No, I didn't, because I, I did the mechanic work on his solar panels. I used to play on these streets. Now there's blood on them. You don't belong here, Rangers. Go home! Time to uh, take the Kodiak out for a bit of a drive since we have the upgraded radiation plating now. Refugees flood the city. Reyes says Rangers are to blame. You read the last issue of the Colorado Patriot? Oh, real funny cartoon in there. When Jeffy ripped the robo arm off that scar collector and <laughs> cracked up. No, I meant to go to the map. <laughs>
heard you killed that synth that was hiding downtown. If anything can make Wolf smile, hey, that'd be it. Remember that day we took the General Duke out and did donuts in old man Hutchins carrot patch? <laughs> Boy do Hell yeah. Let's go. How are you feeling, car? Unable to process. Please repeat query. Never. Help! Please, if you can hear this. They killed my brother and now they're coming for me. They're cannibals. Fucking wannabe cowboys. They're barbecuing people at the quarry. Please hurry. Please. I don't have much. Y'all here for the barbecue? Oh, help yourselves! And make sure to say hello to me. <laughs> To my jamboree. Now step right up and 
You ain't had nothing like this, friends. This little lady's been slow roasted till the meat just falls off. Okay. There, partners. Names were. You ain't had nothing like this, friend. Ooh -wee. I knew you folks was all right. Listen, now that we all acquainted, there are five folks I'm looking for. A young feller named Alfred. Last I heard, Larry and the Daryls are bison ranchers. I want them back, dead or alive. Understand? You find them. You let me know. Move it down to the ground. Cool it down. Move it down. Move it down. Everybody have fun tonight. Everybody have fun. So close, just let yourself go down.
Executing order. to go. Got him. Executing order.
Oh, clone.
my workshop you see that pitmaster suit <laughs> but i'd appreciate it if you kept out This might be one of those fights where we uh, drag people back. and doesn't troll. Love with long
crab, please. Crab, scare crab, crab. Frighten, crab, crab, crab. What crab and crabs, Ruby? Crab, crab, crab. How you doing, man? Crab, 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 and. <laughs> yeah, I'm not doing too badly, mate. Hey, got him. Okay, so that guy has a Molotov. Let's try focusing on him because he'll have extra range because of his height. If we could kill him, the front line shouldn't be getting bombed. Yeah, it's going good, Roby. The fights are getting a lot harder than they have been, so it's been fun sort of lo like loading it up, giving it a go, and then loading it up again. <laughs> Because uh, I keep forgetting that when you um, load, it selects all your party members automatically instead of just the one person you're holding. So I keep having to <laughs> reset the positions, which is frustrating. But that's just me like stuff. <sighs> okay. Do you want to swap Elusive and Lucio around because she just has such a short range. And fuck you. And I'll fucking do it again. Yeah, the problem is, Ruby, it's, it's not necessarily about um, getting smart. It's, it's This game is like, can be really like random numbered, so they'll rely on it. So even good strategy and stuff, you can still find yourself in a weird position simply because the game rolled a few dice and said, well, yes, but no. <laughs> Giving it a go. We haven't played Fire Emblem in ages. It was a good game, though.
What the hell? Oh, it's... He's got some sort of super flamethrower. Get him, guys! I've got the three houses one. I've played it, but I didn't finish it. Um, but there's a new one out too that I've got to look at getting. Uh, no. Wait, did she kill him? Oh damn, she just straight up killed him. Alright. Love you, sniper. Dead to rights.
<laughs> Just a whole bunch of Pokeballs there, Ruby. Sounds about right. some help. Thank you. 
heart is so annoying. get to it and turn it off. Oh, once all the fire starts, it's bloody hard to sort of know what to do. Oh, did the thing where I moved and it had all been selected. this goes. And Kodiak, I know you want to do stuff, but you can't. Sorry, bud. like companion guys to stay back <laughs> well to be fair if I pulled all my people back 
could I could make them get blocked off with two turrets. bit late for this attempt. More turrets. really can't help. I, I could load up, but I, I want to see how this goes. Oh. Yeah, we'll just load. Looking at it, I'm like, ugh. Problem is, like, I've got all the, like, the the pets and allies and stuff, and you can't control them at all. Can't influence what the AI tells them to do, and sometimes they just, it feels like they do some really dumb stuff. <laughs>
Alrighty, we might be able to do it. I was far enough away that my team doesn't count as in combat, so all the pets haven't fucking... popped out to do their stuff. Still at it, yeah. <laughs> okay. Bam blam. Thank you very much for the PDs, elusive. How you doing today? Got him. I'm glad you're doing all right. You say it's not necessary, but I feel like it is. <laughs> Oh, 
he's fucked. <laughs> I know, I know it's, you know, you, you always say it's not necessary to, to, to thank you, but it always just makes me happy that you know, people are having a, g a good enough time to, to sub or to, to, to you know, to give me bits to donate, to, and all that stuff, you know? So, it is appreciated. It, make, it makes me feel like I'm doing something right. <laughs> Kodiak, you are amazing. I wish I could take you into every single fight. enjoy hanging out with you in the ring. You guys are always really entertaining. So is it, is it just the the big old turret now? It's always a good time in, in watching you guys play Apex, like... 
the level of communication is, is, is fantastic, and then the content of the communication is even funnier. Do something. Jesus! So this is what happens when toasters clap. Absolutely sniped it for a critical. Hell to the yeah. That was actually really cool. Stoked I could actually make that work. Yeah, when, when watching you guys play Apex, every <laughs> every couple of minutes, it's just like everything's nice and cool. You're all chill, and then it's, Daddy, no, fuck me in the ass, ah, and get the fuck out of here, <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> it's great. No, that, that's genuine gamer react. <laughs> Save the person who was calling out. 
Or is that her? Was she the one that they cooked? Because I killed all these guys to like save whoever was on the radio. I have a, a, a sinking feeling that it was her that they were eating. with nobody in it. I guess you can't save that person then. There's no mention of them at all that I can find. It's disappointing, like I came here to save a person from cannibals. This was a cool place to find at least and got a bunch of experience for it. <laughs> the accuracy, yeah. Look. I I've looked all the three of you enough to know <laughs> exactly what I'm talking about. Защите завоевания социализма, за коммунизм. 
Hold from her. <laughs> that shit never uh, gets old. Am I right? Man, the fucking people on, on the radio. It's a November, bunch of fucking in. psychopaths. We're getting a faint signal in your area. If anyone can hear me, the elves are in danger. I need help. Said a husband. He's a tyrant. Affirmative, Team November. <laughs> However. Given that meddling in the business affairs of Santa could ruin Christmas, I'd advise against inter- Just kidding, Team November. Sending you the <laughs> coordinates of the signal. Hopefully it's not as bad as it sounds. Over. Chomp chomp. I'm, s I'm still hoping we can get Supra and Blue affiliates soon. Like I, l I lurk every chance I get, but it's like, ah, uh, I don't know. Like, sometimes I see them at like six or seven people, I'm like, how long, how long has those people been there? Like, what are the, what are the, what is the average? <laughs> That's fantastic, we're getting closer and closer. And I, and I think, like, I've been seeing a lot, uh, like, a few more people in the, in Blues. So, I have to imagine that as, like, the, we, we go on with the, the days, it'll cut those, like, uh, sorry, I am tired, my brain is, like, working in not the right order. Um, so, you know, like, Twitch always looks at the, your current, sort of, 30 days previous, so every time it ticks over a new day, they cut that that one at the end off. So I have to imagine that if Blue keeps doing what Blue's doing, then the average will just get better. Even if she doesn't get more numbers now, if she just maintains what she's got, it'll cut off all those like really, really low days. So I'm confident we're going to get there. Well, that's quite strict. Why don't you have a look around? You Rangers! 
I'm glad you came. Mary? I can't talk with Santa here. Tell him there are fresh oh, cookies oh, in the hold kitchen. Hold on, Do I hear flying from one of Blood Hill? <laughs> My little busybody. Cookies? Oh, I love a good cookie. The yeah, pecan chocolate chip, or salted caramel crunch, or oh, a minty chocolate chip. Let me have a look at what's baking, and I'll be right back. A cookie would really bake. This isn't a toy factory, Rangers. We are slaves and produce a terrible drug called brain candy. You can find the recipe in his shack out back. Maybe you can use it as proof for oh, leverage. Oh, oh, no. There He's were no coming. cookies left. Whoever ate them is definitely going on my naughty list. Be sure to bundle up, it's cold outside. We'll give it a go. I'm just about ready to call it and then try and just get a little hour or two to just chill out and have a maybe have a nap with the cats and then go to work. Ooh. Yeah, I know. No right chomp. Keep coming over here and you keep flumping and I keep not flumping with you. Okay, ow. These things fucking hurt. Dead to I'm clearly not meant to be here. <laughs>
going, frog, come back. Everyone else on Overwatch, see if Froggy comes back. Hey, Zabo. How you doing, bud? Thank you very much for the raid. I hope your stream was going well. Alright, come back, Angry Frog. Get him! Hey, hey. Is that toxic spines? Toad eye. Get some skin. And Santa has. Uh, is running a uh, slavery operation right now, so we're investigating him. Check out the concerns of the elves. because she's trying to sleep and I keep moving and doing things that really annoy her. Santa is running a slave operation to make a drug called brain candy, but he's literally the like role playing as a bloody Santa's village. the recipe we use it as proof We're like hey why are you making drugs hmm?
Workshop, you know, it just ain't uh, ain't what I imagine Sanders to be like. <laughs> but I think we'll pull back, and, uh, and then we're gonna call it. We're gonna probably raid out to someone. Cause uh, yeah, we're gonna get a little bit of a nap in before work. It's like 4 a.m. right now, so. There we go. So we'll leave it for a few minutes while I organize the readout, and I just uh. Thank everyone just for coming in, hanging out. You know, we had a couple follows. You know, we had a couple of raids. <laughs> Sorry, I wasn't uh, streaming for too much longer, Zabo, but we'll uh, we'll raid out to Brasden. I think, and keep it going. But uh, yeah, thanks for everyone coming in. Uh, elusive again with the the chatting and the biddies and the the good times and uh, I'll be on tomorrow af after work sometime <laughs> we'll be doing some I'm not sure we'll probably do some more wasteland I'm having a lot of fun with it right now uh even if I am safe scum in the game. <laughs> but yeah. Look, Brazen's a cool dude. We're going to raid him. We're going to make him do his little... His little raid... Uh, thing. Which I always find entertaining. He's got a lot of... A lot of energy when he's not... Uh, when he's not sick. <laughs> but again, thanks everyone. You're absolute legends. I will see you, hopefully, tomorrow. Bye! that stream and don't have big boobs and still uh, pop off, you know? <laughs>